Hi Twin Flames, Lacey here, and I have a reading for you for my one reading a day for the month of August. This is a reading um, that I got a clear message that came to my heart today, and uh, it's your Twin Flame saying, I need you. Now, this is going to get unpacked. This message is going to get unpacked in this reading. What does that even mean? I need you. Um, what, what does that mean? I need uh, you to come and take care of me? Well, that doesn't feel very good. So let's talk about that in this reading. So I've got three decks that I was called to pull. Um, my Crystal Angels by Doreen Virtue, Whispers of Love by Angela Hartfield, and the Moonar Moonology deck by Yasmin Boland. Um, so let's see, what what um, how can we unpack this message from your twin flame? Okay, so um, we know in the uh, nature of twin flames that your twin flame is you. You share the same soul blueprint. You make the same choices as one, and you heal together as one. Um, this is uh, really important because when someone says they need you, there's a misplaced need, right? So when you when you need your twin flame, what you really need is the divine, a source, creator. Some people say God. You really need God to give you all the love that you need, right? But your twin flame is meant to be with you physically. They're, you're not meant to be in separation. You weren't designed that way. And there's a lot of illusion that's separating you from love. So that's what you're healing right now. And uh, let's talk about the energies that are coming out in your union. What is this, this kind of misplaced need coming from? So I'll shuffle the cards. Let's just, I don't have a... Today, I don't have an agenda for how many cards I'd like to pull. I just want to keep pulling until we feel satisfied that we got the message, though. There's a card coming out. Um, let's see what else is coming out. Okay, nice. Oracle cards don't go upside down. Um, then, Moonology deck. What is... Okay, I've got that one flipped up already for you. Focus on love and answered prayers. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this neediness, you've been, your heart has been crying out for the divine, for love in general, right? You've been crying out for your partner. And did you know that your partner is your creator and through your twin flame as well? You're designed, your creator created you to have an ultimate lover. And you're designed to be with that person in this lifetime, right? Um, answered prayers, focus on love, and a new start is coming. I don't see how, <laughs> how the divine could be any more clear than that. It's reassurance. So what you needed to feel loved in that place where you were hurt, um, coming into this reading is you need reassurance. And this is what God is providing for you right here. Uh, God is answering your prayers about the situation. God is telling you to focus on love. Don't focus on the thing that you don't have. Focus on love, right? And then a new start is coming. When you choose this, when you choose to, ah, my prayers are being answered, have faith in this. And when you choose to focus on love, this is going to feel like a new start. So this is really good. But I want to go deeper. Okay. So there's there's something else that you need that you're, you and your twin flame both need. This I need you energy being misplaced onto something else that you need to feel loved. So let's find out what that is. We're actually doing the mirror exercise here a little bit. Stress reduction. <laughs> How many of you watching this video feel really stressed right now? There's an energy in the collective about overworking. Feeling like you can't take a break. Feeling like you've got too much to do, too much on your plate. Let's see. What reassurance. Aw, miracles and blessings. You're really, I, I can really feel... The divine feminine uh, aspect of God, mother God coming out. Okay, good. Okay, we've got stress reduction, watermelon tourmaline, de-stress your mind, body, and schedule as you need to rest, recharge, and revive. Please pay attention to that. It is safe to rest, right? When you feel like you're tired, have you ever heard the acronym hungry, angry, lonely, tired, halt? When you're feeling any of those feelings, um, a lot of times you might like reach out for a person to help you, um, but you're just really tired. So it's time to rest. Miracles and blessings. Everything has its gift. This is absolutely. So look at how gentle the picture is. Look at how peaceful the leaves are floating down into the girl's hand and how you can peacefully receive 
uh, your love. You can receive love rather than than feeling like you're panicking and reaching and grasping for it. It's right there. You don't you don't need to worry. It's right there for you. Time to take action. New Moon and Aries. This card is very cool because when it's uh, next to these two cards, it's taking action to love yourself, taking action and bringing that love into your heart. So um, I like that. And I wanted to share with you that from now, and, and I don't, I'm not sure when you're watching this, but from now until August 23rd, 2020 at 11.59 p.m. midnight, I believe that'll be tomorrow, um, you can uh, get a deep discount on Twin Flame Ascension School enrollment fees for their e-courses, uh, workshop recordings, CD, um, and especially Twin Flame Ascension School and Life Purpose class, right? Uh, so these will guide you back into harmony with your Twin Flame and you get lots and lots of support. So this might be referring to that, like taking advantage of that sale, like Twin Flame Ascension School uh, tuition for lifetime is $2,222 on sale usually it's three thousand three hundred thirty three so really choose to uh go check that out i've got the links in the description here in this video so go check that out um and choose to invest and i will support you there i have um i am a master certified ascension coach and i have some coaching sessions to give you um if you join the school or if you join and or, or enroll in one of the e-courses i have a reading for you just to get you started when you join um, so let me know if you want to talk about that also if you want to take some action and book an introductory session with me to help work through some of these blocks in your union I am right here and available and um, and I would love to support you because I know I could never have do, done it on my own let's find out if, if uh, the divine has any other messages this is really really um, really positive. Uh, let's see if the divine has any other messages for us today. What does the divine want to tell us about things that we may need that we may not know that we need? Ooh, amethyst. I love that color. That is a really beautiful color that's really speaking to me right now. I've got appreciate the moment. Good. It's coming into your present self and ooh, we got two cards come out. You're good enough and look at the bigger picture. Okay. So um, what these cards all tell me together is that when you're present with how you feel, revealing your true self and appreciate this moment, go to hand in hand. When you're present with how you feel, that is when you're restoring harmony within yourself. You come into all of who you are and notice if you feel any... Um, feelings of rejection or guilt or um, not feeling good enough, right? Give yourself love there in that place. That is where you restore your harmonious union with your twin flame to harmony. Um, look at the bigger picture means zoom out for what of whatever it is that you're focusing on that you're you're kind of fixating fixated on in your union and um, and choose to love yourself instead. You're good enough. You're good enough for love. You're good enough for your union, right? You're good enough for your twin flame. And they're good enough for you because you're both designed to be together in this lifetime and partner together to help restore humanity. So I feel like this is very complete. I feel like this is a really good message from God. I really appreciate that God is is uh, continuing to almost like kind of say the same thing over and over. If you watched my videos, message is coming out, but you know, God doesn't care that you may have resistance to love. He'll keep loving you. He, you know, he, she, whatever you'd like to call God, um, will keep loving you and keep guiding you. Um, so thank you so much for watching this reading. I hope you have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can get one reading a day for the rest of August. I'm going to actually go to September 2nd. I lost a couple of videos on a couple of days. Um, so I extended by two days. So thank you, lots of love to you, and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.